Hey guys, what up? Um, I inspired by Disney here. Um, and actually, I, I was gonna upload this to their video yesterday that I spent five hours on, but YouTube decided to block it because I played music and I even gave the people credits. But you know, YouTube is rude as hell, so that just ended that. Um, so anyway, uh, today we're going to be doing a Cormorant Rant class tutorial, and hopefully they don't block this one um, again, um, like the other one. But it's all right because, yeah. Um, yeah, so Cormorant class. Uh, the reason is this albatross is boring me. Doesn't make as much money as my old one, so I don't see the reason to keep her around anymore. And, uh, you know, Cormorant's a nice ship, and I know there's a 2,500 2, alpha players out there that can use Cormorant. Uh, 2,500 players that have access to Cormorant, that's how I should say it. Um, and so, yeah. Uh, this mainly for them, and if you're or and or if you're interested in the Cormorant class, but our name, to buy it because you didn't know about Alpha. Well, that's also a reason to watch the video. Um, so yeah, so unfortunately YouTube did actually block it, even though I literally said countless times credits to the uh, these person, uh, this person. I didn't make it at all. It's made by them. Um. But yeah, YouTube still decides to do that. So, you know, it is what it is, though, because obviously they didn't listen to me literally giving the person credits. Um, but yeah, all right. Anyway, it doesn't matter because I'm gonna work on it because it says I can just mute the song, mute all the sound during there. Uh, that's an option, so I'm gonna do that. Um, so yeah. Now, assuming you're an alpha player, I'm gonna assume you're decently rich in this for this video um yeah like just enough to afford all these then uh, amenities and everything pull if we could just do a bowling alley i mean that would just be enough by itself pull. no it's kidding uh, actually it could be i don't know all right now let's go to utilities and we're just going to do a small radar mast on this one because cormorant is also really small now Really? I mean, we could just do a tiny smokestack. Just go like that. Um, but I don't think we will. I think what we're going to do is go to Kirby smokestack. No. Large smokestack. No. Three wide. Um, we could do that one, but that's too big for me, so... Um, do whale tail, but that's also kind of big for me. Um, down, deck up, delete. All right. Um, let's do the medium. No, of course we can't center that. Sucks. All right. Uh, small smokestack. Can we center it? Nope. All right. Well, we'll just do it like that then. Alright, so we're going to take our stairs from utilities here. Yeah, that's a problem with these staircases. Nope, undo. Um, Alright, delete those. Alright, um, but, you know what we could do? Instead, why don't we make them go forward like so? Uh, I'm not gonna try and do an atrium on Cormorant because, yeah, that's, as you can guess, that's gonna take up, like, all the space, so... I mean, no, we can't really anyway. Alright, well, that sucks, because I actually wanted to do one kind of, but... Um, yeah, that's as far as I'd be willing to go. Oh, yeah. Alright, 
Yeah, I always get confused on this. Oh. Alright. Okay, so let's go ahead and expand this. Um, and, we, you know, we could try nature room if you guys are really desperate. But I'm not ensuring tons of profit then. Because we only have like three decks to work with. So, yeah. Alright. So. <sighs> We're gonna do a small pool. And the reason we're doing a small one is so it doesn't take up too much space. And we could try to do our food on deck. And the only reason I would actually be willing to is because, see, that way we can have more space for if we want to try an atrium. Um, but, yeah. That should be enough seating, I think. That's 16. So this holds 20, so... 1632, right. And technically speaking, they don't all have to eat at the same time either. Um, because someone will be leaving wine as someone's getting in, so. Alright. Yeah, I just wish YouTube wasn't so rude, honestly. Although, at least they do try to help you, like, but still. Like, if... If you were to just listen to the credits, I mean, as long as someone literally credits, oh, it's not my work, it's, uh, High Hopes, uh, Panic, no, it's Panic at the Disco, High Hopes, not my music. So, I'm not even gonna bother trying to play this game music, because it's probably gonna do the same thing. But it's, like, so weird, I see people play these all the time, and they never get copyright. The game is biased. No kidding, though, but... <clears throat> Dang, though. If we could actually use all that just for that. Uh, and then the bot the next deck... You know, I don't think I'm going to try an atrium in this tutorial. Now, the reason I say that is because... <laughs> Guys, I don't really want to do one, but... Um, meh, no. If we didn't have the pool, but I like to have the pool. Uh, oh, actually, no. Uh, let me try something. Mm. That's the only way I do an atrium is if we delete this pool. But then what? I don't really know what to put up here. Uh, and then we lose all that space down there, too, so. Hi. Uh, alright. Um, oh, also, is that against that? No. Oh, that's a problem. Um, alright. Uh, we could try a small atrium, but... I kind of like this pool concept to pure better, but, you know, it is what it is, so... Alright, so for activities, uh, let's go ahead and take our... Ours? Uh, what? Me, confusion. What I count. What? I'm just morally confused right now. No, they changed my tag. I like 4046, but now it's 
Oh, uh, he brought. I'm like, what do you mean? Oh, I think he thinks my. Oh. What? Is this the new bow? New boat, yeah, sure. Because we paid two hundred and fifty. Well, some people don't have that. Yeah, beta players don't get uh, cormorant. Yeah, the alpha reward was... I mean, 250 Robux isn't a lot, but I mean, it is more than 25, so credits, Haggy did granitely give us. Yeah, you paid 25. Yeah, no, betas don't get the al uh, Cormorant cost. No, you can get the Albatross as beta. I still don't like the concept of free people getting albatross, because some of us had to wait forever, but, you know, it's alright, because I honestly don't care, because, you know, I just gotta adjust the changes, and it's nice to see people enjoying it, but some people just, like, disrespect it, like, bigger boat plucks me, um, um, but, yeah, the only reason I use Cormoran is just to differ from people, and Cormoran's nice, because it's small, Hugo Dosi. Um, yeah, I call him Dosey. I don't know why. It's just, um, I, no, I said Dose, but I said, like, Dose Y, and he's like, why you call me Dosey? So I'm like, oh, hi. <laughs> um, right, so that's a long story. Um, right, so, anyway, um, yeah, I like beta people, the free people, uh, you know, I, see, you know, here's the thing I like about alphas and betas, no offense, free people, they get when I, if you start testing stuff, I post a picture of me just putting balconies entirely everywhere in Albatross, and guess what? Too much balconies, I know, that's why it's not a permanent ship. Um, but yeah, so sometimes free kids can be annoying because they don't get the concept of we like to play around because we have a crap ton of money. Scottish Pigeon and I and Kevin, we all like to play around with our ships, so really, yeah, that's... Oh, and Sandbox PC, because... Can you be one of my... What? Yeah, those can be my captain. Uh, no, just because... Yeah, because I don't really care. And I, he likes to roleplay with me on just get in Cruise Ship Tycoon, so that's why it's fun. Yeah, Meyer Werft here is building us a new ship. Woohoo. Some people don't like the Alpha Boat, but there's only 2,500 copies available for uh, Alpha players. So, yeah. Sorry, guys, I can make that. But sometimes my throat gets itchy. So, anyway, um, because I talk a lot and uh, I drink all my water. So, uh, that's. A what? Yeah, at some point we'll be able to have captains and crap, but, uh, but I just hope multiple, I wish that Haggy would put multiple ships and captain in the same update. The reason is this, for him to change this to when you click this, just to remove this, 
All it has to do then is just no different than when you buy a new ship, and all it has to do is just duplicate. Oh, well, it's not that easy, is what some kids said. Well, I guarantee you Haggy could literally, I guarantee you Haggy set it up so when he when he's ready for to do multiple ships, it'll be easy to change out. I flip and guarantee it. It's like a guaranteed factor. I doubt he made it impossible, because, yeah. Now, bowling only has 18, but this has 15. This does, this takes up a crap ton of space. This takes up a small crap ton of space. Um, so that's the difference on that. Um, now actually what we're going to do is put a small little lifeboat. Like two. Uh, and two. Now the reason is because, see, if the ship starts sinking, well, I don't know. If the ship starts sinking, that way they can be evacuated. Yeah, yeah, guys, sorry, I'm never playing music again, because I don't want to, I spent literally hours and hours and hours on that over a course of a few days, actually a few weeks, but, and just for YouTube to be like, nah, uh, 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 yeah, like, really, even if you give them credits, it's like, no, so, that is just so stupid, so, yeah, I'm not going to even try to mess with it, if they... It's still being processing. <sighs> UMG. Oh. Yeah, you know who got mad? WMG. Oh, yeah, UMG and SME don't care, but WMG is... Oh. Really? My favorite song hates me. That's great. Yeah, High Hopes and... Um, see you again. Yeah, those are... Bro, that's so stupid. Alright, well, never, A, never play music in a video game. Uh, uh, now... I might actually try to experiment, see if I can actually get... And I wonder if I actually got a copyright strike for that. Seriously, if you give them credits, they're like, no. That's so stupid. There's a way to see copyright claims, so I'm actually curious if I did get one for that. But seriously, it's like, if you give someone credit, I mean... Oh, I'm actually able to see my recent subscribers in the last month. That's great. Alright, um... 450 subscribers, that's good. I'm glad you guys like the content I try to push out on, um, but... 57,000 minutes of watch time. Subscribers, 59 uh, this month. That's not too bad, though. And I... I'm not... I, I'm just trying to grow this channel, but not to a point to where it's just like ZoMG on PewDiePie. Um, but yeah. <sighs> hey, YouTube Studio. All right, yeah, guys. Sorry, I'm just trying to see if I actually got copyright strike for that. I wouldn't doubt it because, yeah. <sighs> sorry. Like, there is a way to see if you got copyright strikes. So. 86,000 views. That's pretty big. Alright, uh, no. Whatever. Uh, well, no, it is big, but, like, yeah, just whatever. I'm not gonna even deal with this. So, let's just continue on the cormorant. I'm uh, sorry for... So. Here's what we're gonna do. Blizzard boat? What? What? Oh, uh, he or she left anyway, so. 
Me. What? Alrighty. I don't really want to do a small atrium, but... <laughs> yeah. It's as big as we're gonna do it, guys. Um, that atrium, that sorry, it's just as big as that's gonna get. Um, now... Right, so... When I see you again, it's been a long way... Oh, wait, no, don't sing it or else you get copyright strike. Right, so if this video doesn't upload, I'm literally going to go to Google. Seriously. Alright, um, anyway, um, so, technically I don't think it really matters unless you play the composer's song, so, anyway, alright. I don't really care, I, like, I'm not going to sing. If I do want to start singing, you know what I'm going to do? Mute my mic. Um, just so I don't have to waste time to get this video muted again. Now, yeah, like seriously, YouTube. I mean, why don't you work on your TOS before you start copywriting people? Because even though they give fair credits and literally shout and like say 10,000 times this video is not made by me, we're still gonna copyright strike you because we have nothing else better to do. Yeah, we won't even apologize for it either. Like seriously. <laughs> um, but whatever. I don't really care. I mean. Well, this, that video is going to be delayed by a lot, because, yep, so if you really were looking forward to that starter guide, well, it's YouTube's fault, so, sorry, I, I not me, sorry, YouTube disappointed, uh, because, yeah, no, it's not my fault, because, here's the thing, I see people play these songs all the time, and they, and on these big YouTube channels, PewDiePie, and all these, okay, people like PewDiePie who have, like, massive channels, they don't say anything to them, but, like, they target the small channels, like, um, no, not PewDiePie, not, not, no offense to them, but, like, YouTube just likes to target the smaller channels, which is ridiculous, but it's just how they roll, so, either way, whatever, uh, let's just go ahead and continue, so, anyway, uh, we're gonna make an atrium on the ship, now, the reason is this, um, well, we moved that pool, um, so, yeah. Now, it's not going to be much furnished because, I don't know, we're just not going to try furnishing it. Now, oh yeah, this boat is always even. So, if you want to do a doorway, you got to do a three wide doorway. Alright. Alright, um, so. I mean, I guess that's my fault for playing that music, but seriously, I mean, they always go for the small channels. Like, oh, why don't you say anything to the big people? Well, maybe because they're actually making the money. And YouTube only cares about money, then. Which, most companies are that way, anyway. But, yeah, whatever. I don't really care. Uh, we're just gonna keep making content if they want to keep blocking it. Be our guest. Um, but, yeah, alright. So, anyway, um... Okay, um, hopefully they don't block this video, because if they do, I'll just make another channel and upload from that, so, uh, alright, um, so what we can do is take our food stand, or Despaquitos, and the reason I'm doing Desp, I don't know how this fits 10 people in line, I swear, I there's no way I believe it fits 10 people. Bowling alley. Phew. Oof, alright. It's been ooh. Oh yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna mute my mic so I can get my eh, somewhat joy out, I guess. I don't know. Alright. So yeah.
Alright, so, um, yeah, bowling alley. Uh, something incorporated. Uh, entertainment. Please rock it. Um, but, yeah. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do up here. So, go ahead and wall this off, because you guys always complain about too many windows. So, for those people that complain about windows... No, not all of you. Uh, just some people complain about too many picture windows, which usually... Go look on, like, a Disney ship or a Royal Caribbean ship. Whole top deck is windows, so that's kind of where I get the idea from. But anyway, uh, let's just go ahead, and for those people, we're going to do our windows. I sort of actually like these windows. You know, I used to never use them, but... And I'll tell you... Ah! That song is stuck in my head now, because when I was playing it during the Saturday guide, which got blocked by YouTube. Um, so... Alright. Alright, uh, there we go, guys. So, we got our windows, and actually the windows do look really nice for the bowling alley. And they look alright for here, too. So, good. Alright. Now we're gonna keep these picture windows for that, so... This is why I didn't want to do it, though. Now we can only fit, like, five rooms. See, and this is the problem. You see what I'm saying? We can only fit, like... Alright, since we're going to try and cram them in here, uh, there's going to be no hallway. It's going to be exterior hallway, meaning that we just click remove here. Alright, uh, come on, remove. Uh, we just go yeet, 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 yeet. Oh, wait, no, undo. Uh, and then we're just gonna do the same over here. Yeet, yeet, yeet. Just yeet the, just yeet these windows. We don't need them anymore. And then we can take your wall here and block it off. Now the reason we're doing it this way is because, well, we want to cram as much guests as we can and as much money as we can. So, because as you guys all know, I don't do the bottom deck. Now I might have to in this tutorial, meaning the ship will be slow. Um, but it would be worth it, I guess. So. Well, did Dose leave? Oh, no, he didn't. Rip. I think Dose is working for Albatross if he doesn't have one already. Well, I made him buy Alpha. <laughs> like, I no, I didn't make him, but I think he thought it was fun, so he's like, alright. Alright, I feel like I should try a few rooms back here, too, because, again, I have two restaurants uh, for you guys, so why not? I mean... Okay, now if I was smart, I would move these over and undo that, and I would put this here. And I'd take our mini suite here, and I would put this here. And then, you know what else I'd do? I'd take these room, these uh, double bout cabin things, and put these here. Oh, uh, which... <sighs> mm. Alright, so then what we're going to do is take our wall, and then just go yeet yeet, and then what we're going to do is take these and just go move them, and then what we're going to do is actually, um, now, I know, like, we won't be able to get there, but trust me, those NPCs will literally just walk right through it, so, um, yeah, not the most realistic simulating part, but people do it all the time. I watch some other Cruise Ship Tycoon videos, and just from experience, I've seen them do it, so... Alright, um, so what we're gonna do is actually put a few plants. Now, the reason being is because plants are, god, uh, no, I was kidding. Uh, plants are alright, um, and, uh, yeah, nothing is, god, it's just an overreaction. Well, okay, just never mind, but it's just an overreaction, that's what I mean. Alright, okay, um, so let's go ahead and take floor. Like, just a high expression of something. Like, technically, if you believe in god, there's only one god, which is god um so yeah anyway uh that's let's not talk about that because uh, yeah all right uh because some people i know don't really you know all right um so anyway uh let's go ahead here uh this atrium is too big uh, i think so this is four meaning four there so really we should make it a block smaller uh which i think we are going to do because then i think we could actually fit more rooms Four, four. No, we couldn't. All right. Uh, no, then we're not gonna do that. All right. So then what we're gonna do is go to utilities. Now this ship will be great for docking in Orion. Well, that high pier. Um. So yeah. So we're just gonna go yeet yeet, and then the reason I say yeet, I don't know, because I hear people say it all the time. So, all right. Um. So furnishings, and we're gonna take this. 
center it. And then we're gonna like put plant. Plant. I love plants. JK. Actually plants are alright, so. Alright. Oh, you know what's cool about these scam bots in this game though? When they leave. Oh yeah. Yep, I was gonna say. Anyway, so when they leave, it deletes. If I rejoin, I probably wouldn't see it because they left the game. So, or it, so it works like that or something. So, all right, and what we're gonna take is take our. This should help our basic needs reading. You know, amazingly, we crammed a lot to it into a small package. Alright, so what we're gonna do is actually, yeah, let's have, let's have that bathroom empty out into there. Now, the reason is this. Dude, I so wanted to tell that guy, wait, your message is gonna delete, so play the game. Yeah, don't fall. Never fall for those scam ads, please. They join and then leave because it's a bot. Now the only way I believe it is if there were actual people that were staying and not like leaving. But that's the only way I'd ever believe. Now, obviously, don't please don't believe them because they're just scams. They steal your account. Well, actually, those ones don't, uh, but what happens is they, like, make you do, like, these IP things and crap, so, yeah, just point being, don't do it, just ignore them, because they're just scam ups, because some people, you know, don't know, oh, ooh, ooh, I can get tons of free Robux, no, you can't, uh, nothing is free, uh, even if something says it's free, it's not free, it's being paid for by someone, uh, when you get, um, and what I mean by that is, it is free for you, but someone is actually paying for it in the long run, so. Alright, so. Um, now, the reason we're doing a bench is because, I don't know, why not? I mean, come on, bench, benches are, alright, so. No, people like bench, and bench is bench. Now, it's got decoration and entertainment, and I don't want to just have all couches in this atrium. So, just to change it up. Oh, actually, let's move this. Let's just face it towards the front. So then it's kind of like a guide in a way, if you want to. With, alright. Alright, back here, what to put. So, the only thing this is actually used for is to get to the pool. Meaning that... Um... What could we even put back here? I don't want to put rooms, and there's a reason for that. Oh, when I say I have a reason for that, I actually don't. Oh, you can place these inside? What the heck? Oh, that's great. No, I, I just wanted to see if he'd actually, like, wait and hold on for a second, but no. Since it's a buy, yeah, that should have been obvious. I feel like these people get forced to, like... I should actually visit the site and see what happens. Uh, it's, it literally says not secure... Oh. They're gonna have Emerald Theater to Light Theater. Oh, yeah. Just don't go to the site, guys. It's just like any other site that says claims to give you free Robux, which obviously it doesn't. Um, so don't. Please don't. I know most people won't, which is get. Bruh, they literally renamed Emerald Theater. The heck? 
Wait, what? Some real data like merging and light theater. Oof. Why are they advertising that? They're advertising a competitor. Isn't that just interesting? All right, let's continue. So, classic thing. Who are, anyone that watches my videos, you know what we're gonna do. Um, so we're gonna actually do chain. We're actually gonna put a bench here, just like we totally always do. Um, and then we're gonna come on. Where's the left end? Oh, there's the left end. All right. Uh, and then we're just gonna go Yeats and Yeats, and that finishes bench. Um, and then what we're gonna do is just a whole row of benches, JK. Uh, no, we're actually going to put two tables. Uh, why? Well, sometimes people like to use tables, so. Hey, yeah, that's it. Uh, and then we're gonna put a few sun beds. And hey, guess what, guys? We changed up the bow style. Uh, a little bit. Um, so yeah, that's the bow. Um, and then up here, we're done there. Uh, and then up here, we're done there, so I think the ship is done minus the engine room. Alright, uh, okay, so let's see how many people we have. Now the rating's gonna be crappy right now because we don't have food. So we have 28 passengers, meaning that's one freezer would actually be enough if I calculate right. 28 times 20, 560. So, right, so if there's 28, okay, that's how many are gonna be used in a day times three. Oh, we could go three days with one. Um, so meaning we're going to do two. <sighs> okay, we can go nine days. Before, if I swear, if that one guy dislikes the video because it's low fuel, and low storage, no, don't even start. Either that or you overuse fuel, which is actually usually the case. So, um, right. And I think we have too much fuel, so that might be a problem. Refuel, resupply. Yeah, you know we have too much supplies for this ship. Um, but yeah, that one guy who has low fuel, and low storage. Yeah, I don't even start, pub. Actually, he doesn't have a cormorant, so I don't expect to see him in this video. All right, let's see. Yep, this is definitely enough fuel. I mean, heck, we could get from here to there. So, if we can go all the way up there, actually, we have too much fuel, but, you know, it's alright. It's, we're good, so. Um, also, let's put a few batteries, because we have, like, three solar panels or something, so. Alright, well, that wraps up today's news, guy. Why not? Um, <laughs> although some people wish we were. Um, so. We're just going to add another fuel tank, uh, just and a battery, just to make people feel better. That always complain about low fuel and low storage. Which actually, if you if you did the game calculations right, you use too much fuel and you use too much storage. Um. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, and we are not done yet. I just like saying that. So uh, let's just put a few sunbeds down here, cause is it decoration? It is. All right. Now, the only reason I'm putting them back here is because it's decoration. I mean, come on. Um, so, also, if you want to help your decoration rating and you can afford it, take marble and just yeet it uh, across the whole engine room floor. Alright, guys, that wraps up. No, I was kidding. Uh, another psych. Alright, um, outdoor secondary, uh, indoor secondary. Uh, both of these are the same trim because that way it creates the cover thing. So, yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Well, just a kidding. Um, no, we're not done yet. So, um, yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna stop psyching now. Okay. Alright. So, we have too much fuel now, and too much storage. Or supplies, I should say. And then you still get that guy, low fuel and low storage. Actually, do your calculations, and then tell me if that's low fuel and low storage. 
All right, uh, 560 divided by 13, or by 5,000. Uh, yeah. Now we can go for like 10 or 100 days. So, I mean, wait, no, 100 days is too much. 560. Okay, 5,200. Wait, 5, 2, 5, here. Divided by 560. Yeah, we can go for 9 days. Too much fuel supply, so. Alright, well, now this is actually my main save slot, so this is going to be a permanent chip. I hope this thing gets good rating. Okay, why isn't this updating? If we have like a 4 star crowdedness, 4 star, why the heck isn't it? And then we have five star, five star varieties about four. So why is it still on three point five? It's supposed to go to the three point nine. All right, we'll give it a second, I guess. All right, let's head over to Island. Oh, there we go. That's what I want to see. Oh yeah. Also back here, let's put a bathroom. The reason is basic needs. Yeah, if you care about your basic. Now, no one, you can't even see in the actual stalls, so people, yeah, so the polar bear thing from this one weird video thing, um, yeah, that's not possible. Oh, yeah, Cormorant didn't have nameplates uh, at one point, so then I kept begging, ha uh, bugging Haggy, and then he just added them, because I think, I think he was planning on it, but, like, it's like, yeah, it's just, like, Adam blocks. We're going 67 knots. Jeez. This isn't really being low fuel and low storage, I don't think so. You still get the guy that says low fuel and low storage. Oh, uh, that's great, isn't it? Oh, really? Uh, you know what I should do? Um, is, uh... Yeah, I'm actually gonna do that. Where are you? Starter guide, starter guide, time lapse, CST 8, 10, 19. If I can't rename this, then this is what. Oh, yeah. Alright. Alright, we made 29k in 6 hours, meaning I have a good feeling about this shit. Meaning, uh, we're gonna go another. Let's just do our loop here. Uh, you guys don't have to. But the reason I'm doing it is to see how many profits, how much profits we make. I'm also curious how much this ship is worth. 464k, wow. That sounds right. Actually, I like having an atrium on Cormorant. It's really nice, and the fact that you can actually look in the bathroom is just scary, but... Oh, boy. Um... Alright, you know what we're gonna do? For reasons, you we're just gonna make it that tile smaller. Oh, and we hit the placeholder island, and now we're just gonna burn through fuel. Um... Yeah, alright. Alright, guys, I'm trying to make this quick. If you hit the island, just go ahead and dock. Alright. Alright, so that's the improvement. Uh, we got more entertainment. The bathroom isn't seeable. Uh, see, then you could say that polar bear thing like the one guy said. Alright, 13k to refill. Not bad, considering how much profit we made. So, alright, 15k. Uh, we made 14k in profit. Not too bad to me. Not to mention, that was only six hours, too, so I'm curious to see how much this would make in a full day. So, Alright, well, that's something we're going to find out now. Oh, yeah. And if I, what I was saying, too, is if you do this right, it... Here's the thing. When I... When I we got Pelican, I'm like, oh, we can't fit balconies on each shot. And Osprey. You can fit balconies on each side. It's called, if you do it right, I mean, delete the balcony dividers, you can. And actually, it's cooler like this, having an exterior hallway on each side. Um, but yeah. It's more convenient, too, and then you get a nice walk, too. Now, you don't get a private balcony, but 
you still it still makes as much as a ball pit. To maximize our profits and to give them better rooms is what we're doing. And this is a luxury ship. There's only two rooms that are cheap, like a normal cruise ship will. I feel like this thing could really grind. And the reason I say that is for the 70 knots it can do. Um, like, heck, the wake on this thing is massive. Like, if you can get the two or three ports in it, if we can actually, in this, like, 24-hour thing, if we can get all the way back to Newport, oh, the nautical miles are gonna be huge. Uh, well, and then we're gonna have the two or three port bonuses, too, so... Yeah, Cormorant is nice, and, you know, I really am glad this is a good alpha reward. People are like, oh, it's not big, but if you set it up like this, set it up right, yeah, you can make tons of profit. Um, now, I don't know how much this one's gonna make, because usually my Cormorants have, like, 50, 60 people, and then what happens is, um, oh, alright. Oh, a dose left. Rip. Alright, we got a 4.1 on this thing too, so that's not bad at all. We got tons of emet- Entertainment? I'm hoping it's 5 stars. Yeah, it is. It's like 4.9 or 5- no, that's 5 stars. Yeah. Alright. I don't get how this holds 18 people. I don't know, I feel like it can only do 4, 6, Seven and eight, and then I guess you get. Oh no, but I think. Oh, hey, we're already here. Wow. All right, request tug, and the reason I'm doing that is because. Oh. All right, refuel and display. All right, let's go. We need to get to the next port. It's only nine o'clock, meaning that we, dude, if we can get back to that one port, it only took us three hours to get here. So, or if I think right. I'm thinking right on that. Also, yeah, you don't get paid for how long you're there. It, it, as long as you click the dock button there, that's pretty much how the port bonuses work. So. As of right now, in the future, they might add it for like, oh, you were docked there for... But uh, in the meantime, no, it's not that way. Alright, dang, though, this thing can fly. Cruises. They, you want to talk about a cruise ship? Well, yeah, people are like, "Ooh, new ship! When it come out?" So that makes you feel like an admin. All Oh boy, yeah, I do a 10 mile bike ride every day, or at least try to, so I'm gonna do that soon, um, and then I'm gonna eat my salad before dinner, then I'm gonna eat dinner, and then, yeah. Genuinely, I'll skip lunch and eat like a banana or an apple or something. Alright, um, so here's what we're gonna do here. So, as the ship comes around... Alright, come on, ship, pick up speed. I'm not gonna tug there because it really won't take us much to get closer to it. Dude, this thing is sleek too. Like this pelican. I mean, pfft, pelican. No, cormorant. Like, seriously. Yeah, at first, we're like, oh no, an extended Huron, but you know, you gotta really take and appreciate how great this thing is. Alright, we're gonna tug now because I wanna get back to Newport and. Before this 12 hour cycle ends. Now I won't tug to Newport necessarily. If we have time I'll actually go to Orion. Um, but no we're not going to go to tug to Newport. And the reason being is because we have enough time to kill. So, Well eventually we will. But like in terms of right now we're not going to. Because 
uh, even when we're close to it, because the reason being is, I uh, know when we're close to when when it's close when it's like eleven f or, or ten or something, then we'll tag to Newport. But I was just probably going circles around the island. Honestly, could we even get to Iceberg from here? Oh, we could. Yeah, we can almost make it. Uh, no, actually, we only have ten hours until the day ends. One night cruise, dude. That's great, though, isn't it? One night cruise gets you. Yeah, about two nights. Here you go here, 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 and then you go back here. That's pretty good. All right, so we're just gonna keep going here. Hopefully, it works out perfectly. It's like nine or ten or eleven. We'll just let them walk around at Newport, and they'll be off the ship. Then I'll end the video. And yeah. So, yeah, I like my new ship. The Albatross is nice, but you really feel more, I don't know, appreciative that you still get recognized for paying 225 more Robux than beta players. Or, we could try to go to Orion, honestly. Or Iceberg, actually, but... Mm. Problem is this ship is too fast, so you can get around the port easy. All right, uh, let's just go and no, actually, let's just go and laps around Newport. Or we could actually try to dock there, and that might kill some time. Let's actually try to dock there, and let's actually back into my favorite docking spot. You know what sucks about Albatross though? There's this one spot in Newport that I love to park every time, but I can't park there now because. Stupid reasons. Um, no, because Albatross can't fit at either one of these two. And that's what's nice about Huron, where that red guy's at. You get your own exclusive spot. I wish Cormorant would fit there, but nope. Just Huron. Alright, four. See, I'm so amazed how quickly this thing stops, though. Yeah, Cormoran is meant for speed. She isn't meant to be like an albatross where you just load her up with rooms and then a little bit of food and entertainment and like three engines. That This thing is intended to be high speed rail. Well, JK. Well, no, it's intended to be high speed. Um, but you're right. Yeah, this is my favorite docking spot right here. Like, I wish I could dock my albatross here. You used to be able to, but then Haggy patched it. Like, Imp used to always tuck here, uh, and except the back would stick right out, but that's still was cool. I don't know how much it would, oh yeah, it would take them a lot to extend it, actually. I was gonna say, though, they should really, you know what they should do? Take this part and extend it out, and then move the terminal over, just so that way Albatross could fit there. That'd be a nice update. Alright, we're gonna wait till 12 o'clock before we even spend any money. So we did go to a lot of ports. Um, you can see the difference in Cormoran and Albatross. Cormoran is pretty big, though, compared to it. Like, three, four, five. So, you can see, but, I mean. Do Mallard and Albatross is small. Like, no, I just mean in terms of Cormoran's height, because that one... See, technically, it's got that one extra deck. Because, really, um, what they should have done with Cormoran is... Alright, so, you see these? Um, at one point you can put pools down in there, and what, basically, anyway, um, it'd make a hole. Well, that hole, I think originally they were intending, so, in these things, you could actually put, like, an engine down there. Or batteries or something, but, you know, they didn't end up doing that, unfortunately. But this would have been wide enough to do that. Um, and it would have been nice to, like, put your engine fuels and supplies down there or something. You know, it just would have been more space. Now, we're going to lose some money, I think, for just sitting in port. But, no, I think just keeping... Actually, no, I don't think so, because then we're keeping them their full 24 hours. So. But there's tons of things to do on this ship. I mean, I wish we had something like this on the Great Lakes. Except I wish it was, like, the cost of a normal cruise, not, like, 20k per person. Um, alright. Well, that's going to wrap up today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. 174K. 
Oh wow. Um actually pretty good. Okay, rip. Now we're at 79 bucks, but no we did make profit and that's all that matters here cuz that I am inspired by Disney's logs. That's our main goal in this game. All right, uh, let's take the thumbnail here. And I actually want to get that albatross in there. So All right. Okay. Save as newest Cormor Rent class tutorial. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed and uh yep, you all know why I'm not gonna play music anymore and uh yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And I'm still amazed how much we actually fit in this small little ship. Alright, yep, that's gonna wrap up today's video and we'll see you all next time. Woohoo.